Oh, hello. I didn't see you there. <laughs> Isn't that how Phoenix always starts his videos? Hey, Mad Hatter here uh, in this lovely, clean parking garage once again, downtown Austin, uh, to let you guys know that today is a very special day uh, in March of the Scrubs. We have released Balrog's Boombox, which is this utterly rad Street Fighter II, uh, original Street Fighter II themed album uh, that's got King Phoenix attacking with the vocals and untested methods doing his super combos on the beats. Um, it's incredible. Look, it's it's not easy running a label and not playing favorites. Um, I, there's so many projects, there's so many groups that I absolutely love them to death. It's really tough not to talk one up over the other. But I have to say, without a doubt, uh, for many different reasons, that Balrog's Boombox is my favorite Scrub Club release to date. Sets that bar way up there. Um, it's just fucking, it's fantastic. Uh, you've, got, you've got the eight original World Warriors from Street Fighter, right? But it's not like every track is about them or the character or the game itself. Uh, Phoenix took basically like a characteristic of each fighter and then wrote a real personal song about it and how it relates to him. And Untested Methods, man, he takes these original themes and, you know, he cuts it up the way that he does. And he just does an incredible job. Like, it is just, it's, it's the best. It's the greatest. And you need to download it now because it's free. Um, yeah, I just, I just brushing up on my Street Fighter, you know what I'm saying? Listen, listen to what this has to say about Balrog. From a person they hired to obviously had never played the game. Balrog is a formal World Boxing Association title holder. For reasons unknown, he became psychotic and was subsequently banned from the WBA. He now spends all of his time fighting on the streets and back alleys of Las Vegas. Balrog's defense isn't very good, but his crazed punching attacks will do a fighter in if they're not careful to avoid his metal-laced boxing gloves. Straight from Nintendo, the source. 1990-something. Anyway, what I'm trying to say is that Street Fighter has always been an awesome franchise. Now you've got the dopest hip-hop album that has something to do with it. I want you to download it, listen to it, enjoy it, taste it, rub it all over yourselves, have fun with it. <laughs> Um, but as a call to action, if you post on video game related message boards, uh, fighting game pages, uh, if you follow people on Twitter that are into that kind of thing, like blast this out as far as you can, because I honestly think that this deserves, I mean, as far as it can get. Uh, tell Seth at Capcom that he needs to hear it, you know what I'm saying? Uh, I'd love to people reach out to Capcom today and uh, show them what we've made. It's just... I'm a proud papa, you know what I'm saying? It's a brilliant album. Definitely go get it. Um, it's the first uh, major release of uh, March of the Scrubs. You know, we uh, had the single from... Shit. RPG Unit. <laughs> Sorry, just kicked my car. I think I damaged it. Um, and that was fantastic. We got more singles on the way. This is the first album um, that we're releasing out of, I believe, eight or nine. So it's about to get real busy. But uh, this is a great, great album to get. Subscribe to Nintendo Power in the 90s. Uh, download our album. And uh, yeah, much love to you guys. We'll see you tomorrow. Enjoy. Enjoy.